What's cooking today is an amazing 55 plus community palms at Saranoa and this is their Del Rey model home. Stay tuned. It's Amy with Heart and Home Orlando and today I am incredibly excited to finally get to present to you Palms at Saranoa which is a 55 plus brand new community here in Saranoa which is in Claremont. I am super excited for all of the different options that they have for you here. So let's start to take a look at some of the floor plans. So this first one that we're going to look at today is the Delray. So at its core, the majority of the homes here are two bedrooms, two baths. However, this one that we're going to tour today, the Delray actually has three bedrooms. Oh my goodness, this community is amazing. Fantastic amenities as the 55 plus communities typically always have, but here the HOA fees are a little bit lower. Man, oh man, I'm super excited. So let's take a look at this model home, see how it's decorated, the flow, the layout, and we'll talk as we go through the video um, of some of the other things to mention. For instance, the majority of these home sites don't have rear neighbors, so you're gonna back up to private conservation or just dry retention or something where you don't look into somebody else's backyard. But first, let's take a look at the layout. So here we are in our foyer area, and directly to my left or to your right is where we're gonna have the two guest bedrooms. Keep in mind I said two guest bedrooms because Typically speaking, you'll have the master bedroom and then you'll have one guest room. So if you do for any reason feel like you're gonna need that extra space, you might wanna consider this floor plan. So in this Delray, right here at the front of the home, you're gonna have one of those two guest bedrooms. Beautiful big window out the front, letting in all that beautiful Florida sunshine right here. And then directly outside of it, you're gonna have the full bath, which again has the tub shower combo, toilet and sink, cabinet counter mirror, beautiful lighting fixtures, lots of different things in this community that are just going to make you wanna come see it in person, I know. All right, so here is the second bedroom again, tucked back over here. So both of these two guest bedrooms are located up toward the front of the home, which is really nice. So that as you know if you do have friends family guests grandkids someone coming to visit you here they're gonna have kind of their own little week over here located at the front of the home so now back over here down our foyer over to the um, to my right to your left back over here we have two other great rooms the laundry room now the laundry room is not a super fun room but at least you have a nice big large uh, laundry room where you can add some cabinets and counters if that's something you wanted to do after you closed on your home. And in here, you're gonna have this flex space. So one of the things I wanna point out with this flex space is it does have a private door because having that door really does, if you need an office, maybe maybe you're you know 55 plus, but you do still work, you need that office space, great hobby room, all sorts of uses for that particular room back there. Now back over here, we're in the main hub of the home. I really love this. Nice, big, open, airy, spacious, living space. 55 plus community does not mean that you're living in a tiny apartment. You have a big, beautiful single family home. It just means that the community and the neighbors, the people and things and amenities surround you are going to be advantageous to that stage and phase of your life. So this is beautiful. Imagine all of your friends and family are over, your grandkids are visiting you. Lots of space for them to kind of hang out with grandma and granddad, or maybe you're not grandma and granddad yet. But here you are, a big, beautiful space. Nice big kitchen, by the way. Lots of cabinet and counter space. You have a separate dining area over here, your informal day-to-day -day dining. And then of course you have a really large family room area. Now if you're looking for design tips, uh, um, interior design ideas, I love what they did here on this back wall. They did an incredibly beautiful, smart, intricate design with mirrors and trim and a little bit of wallpaper. That is spectacular, really beautiful. Now back over here in the master, um, or in the back corner is the master bedroom. So nice big master bedroom, by the way, plenty of room for a nice big king size bed. From corner to corner, you have lots of space. There's a chair in the corners, so can't quite get in there. But you have a nice big area over here as well. And then of course, I want you to take a look at the backyard space. We'll take a look at it a little 
little bit uh, in, in a minute after we do this master, we'll go look a little bit more and talk about the backyard space. But you do have a beautiful view of that outdoor space from this master bedroom. Now down here, you're gonna have your closet space and you're gonna have your big master bathroom. So one of the things about the master bathrooms in these homes here is that you're gonna have the shower stall and every shower stall is going to have that seat. So obviously that's something that's important. We wanna make sure that we point that out as well. But you have a lot of space in here, a long vanity with two sinks, large mirror, lots of drawers and cabinet space, of course. And then over here, of course, you're gonna have your privacy door for the toilet. And then back over here, you have the separate closets as well. So let's talk a little bit about the outdoor living space. That's the other thing that gets me so excited about this particular community. So this home is on a like a 50, 50 I believe it's a 50 foot wide home site. And the home sites are about 120 feet deep. And now through the magic of television, we are in the outdoor space. So this home site is very typical. If you're looking for the Delray floor plan on a 125 foot deep lot, this is the amount of outdoor living space that you have to work with. Pools not included, by the way, but if you wanna add a pool, this is a great example of how you're not sacrificing anything. And through the rest of the tours of these model homes, you're gonna see different ways that you can design and create your outdoor living space to kind of be conducive to what it is that you want in your vision of how you want your home to feel. But take a look at this space. You have a nice sized pool. It's actually, it's a big, beautiful pool. Plenty of outdoor lanai space if you like to sit out and get some sun. You've also got some covered lanai space as well. And of course, they've also added a summer kitchen. So this is a really good example of an outdoor living space that you could have here on the Delray floor plan, um, but pretty much on the majority of these 50 foot lots, you're gonna be able to see the outdoor space. All right, so this is fantastic. If you like this video tour, make sure you stay tuned go back through my YouTube channel because we're going to have videos of all of the model homes here. And remember, we are out here at Palms at Saranoa, which is a DR Horton 55 plus community in the community of Saranoa, which is in Claremont itself. This is spectacular, brand new, so act quick so that you can get your choice of lots. Man, this is super exciting and I can't wait to show you the amenities. Those are coming up soon as well. All right, guys, thank you again for watching. Don't forget to give me a call at 407-848-8042. Remember, I do not represent the builder. I'm just here featuring this beautiful community because I know so many, many of you have been excited and anticipating their opening. And guess what, guys? It's here. All right, thanks again for watching. Have a great day, everybody, and happy house hunting.